guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I decided to try out some classic 1950s style makeup. So to see how I got this look, just keep watching.
right, so that is it for this makeup look. So, basically, I found my most pink tinted foundation and used that as a base. Um, the website that I used to get this information, I'll try to remember to link it down below, but it also suggested mixing like a cream blush into your foundation, but that just seemed like a little overkill for me. So I just found the most pink one I could find out of the foundations I had, and I used that. Um, I thought I had a cream blush, but I guess I got rid of it at some point since I don't generally use cream blushes. So I used the same lipstick that I used on my lips as my blush. Um, it's not like super visible, but I'm okay with that. I'm not a huge fan of like bright blushes, but yeah. Other than that, um, the eyeshadow, it said, like it gave a list of colors that were like common, but then it also said that during the day a lot, they would try to match it to their eye color, which is why I went with a blue and they didn't use brushes, I guess, because it said to apply it with your finger. So I applied it with my finger. Um, I feel like the 50s, like looking at the layout for how they did their makeup was kind of like almost a starting point to our modern day ways of doing makeup. So that was kind of interesting. Like it even said on there that as the decade went on, the amount of eyeshadow people wore kind of increased. And yeah, like the colors on the lips were starting to change up a little bit. Instead of it just being a red lip, they did reds and pinks and corals and like different shades of things. Um, my eyeliner game was not good today, but <laughs> basically it just started in the middle and then winged out a little bit. And then later on into the decade, I can't talk today, they started to transition into like more of the cat eye style that we know. And yeah, I don't know. I just think it's cute and simple and sweet. Um, would I generally leave my house with only blue eyeshadow on? Definitely not. Especially not just one singular shade, but it is what it is. So if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you're not subscribed to my channel already, make sure you hit that subscribe button. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!